The Great Lakes have been my beat for the past 10 years, and it took a number of years just to begin to understand the issues. The impetus for this series was to really drill down into what the big issues are and, and what the potential solutions are. This project was done in conjunction with uh, Marquette University with a new fellowship they have there called the O'Brien Fellowship, and we work on a, a year-long deep dive project. Mine was about the Great Lakes. The tricky thing about doing a story on the Great Lakes is that it's hard to really step back and appreciate them. We just kind of take them for granted. I think we forget that most all the water on Earth is salt water. Only 3% of, of the globe's water is fresh water. Only 1% of it is melted, and 20% of that, one-fifth of the world's surface fresh water, is right out there. We need to appreciate it and take care of it. And before we do that, we need to understand it. And that's what this project was about. We decided to start with what is the most important issue facing the Great Lakes, and that is pollution, specifically biological pollution, more specifically invasive species. What we needed to do was explain how these invasive species have so fundamentally changed the way things work out in the lakes. It's hard for people to grasp what's going on underneath the surface when it looks exactly the same from year to year. But what's happened out there is a change every bit as profound as a forest fire. Only this one isn't growing back like a forest normally would. These problems here aren't just the Great Lakes problems. If an invasive species takes hold in the lakes, it's inevitable that it's gonna spread across the country. That's not to say all is lost. The lakes have a remarkable ability to heal themselves, and we're seeing that. We're seeing native species surge and actually start competing with these invaders that have done so much to rewire the natural ecology of the lakes. One of the difficult things today when you say you work at a newspaper is that it's not right. It, it is a newspaper, but it's so much more than that. And uh, that's why this award is really important that, it, that we're acknowledged for what we're doing now. It is a multi-platform presentation that takes a whole team of people, from photographers to graphics people to design people. It, it really isn't just words on a page anymore, and it never will be again. There were motion graphics. There were interactive uh, graphics, uh, there were maps, interactive maps showing the spread of invasive species. It was really a dynamic project that only was made full by this multimedia presentation. The thing about this series is it didn't just lay out the problems, it examined some solutions that can be done. 